हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सॉल्व दिस नाइस अलजबरा प्रॉब्लम सो हियर वी हैव बी माइनस फोर एंड इट्स एक्सपोनेंट इज फोर इक्वल्स टू सिक्सटीन एंड वी सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फॉर द वैल्यूज ऑफ बी ओके सो हियर फर्स्ट वी नीड टू फोकस इन द राइट हैंड साइड एंड हियर वी हैव सिक्सटीन एंड वी राइट इट एज b minus 4 and its exponent is 4 equals to we write uh, this is 16 as 4 square and after that we need to move this 4 square in the left hand side and we rewrite our left hand side as b minus 4 square and its whole square minus we write this 4 as 4 square equals to 0 and after this step here we need uh, to uh, use the nice square identity and you know about this identity if we have a square minus b square it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b okay so here we use this nice square identity so according to this identity uh, we write our above uh, equation as because this is b minus 4 square is our a and this 4 is our b so we need to substitute these two values in the right hand side of this equation so that our above equation is written as b minus 4 square minus this is our 4 and into the second factor is a plus b so here our a is b minus 4 whole square plus this is b so our b is 4 and this whole equation equals to 0 okay so further we need to uh, divide this into the two cases so that our first case is to take b minus 4 whole square minus 4 equals to 0 this is our equation number 1 and we take b minus 4 whole square plus 4 equals to 0 and this is our equation number 2 okay so after this step uh, here we need to focus uh, on these two equations so now here first we solve equation number 1 so that from equation number 1 we have b minus 4 whole square and we write it as b minus 4 whole square minus we write this 4 as 2 square and this is equals to 0 and here we again apply this square identity so according to this identity we uh, again uh, write this expression as in this form b minus 4 minus 2 into b minus 4 and plus 2 equals to 0 so here we write this expression as b minus 6 into b minus 2 equals to 0 so here we break this as b minus 6 equals to 0 and b minus 2 equals to 0 so here you get the value of b equals to 6 and the second value of b equals to 2 so these are the two values of b and now we need to focus on second case so uh, we uh, copy down equation number 2 here so equation number 2 is b minus 4 square plus 4 equals to 0 and here we move this plus 4 to the right hand side and it will be written as b minus 4 square equals to minus 4 so in order to find the value of b we need to take the square root on both of the sides so this will be written as this two and square root are gone and we get b minus 4 and here you know that the square root of 4 is 2 and the square root of minus 1 equals to iota Uh, so this implies that we move this minus 4 to the right hand side and it will be written as 2 iota plus 4 uh, so here we place the plus minus sign because we take the square root on both of the sides so that we take plus minus of any one of these these sides okay so here we write the plus minus sign so we write uh, finally we write the second values of b are 4 plus minus 2 iota okay these are the two roots and these are the two roots of the given equation so these are the four roots of the given equation after that here we need uh, to verify these four roots of the given equation so here we write the four roots are b1 equals to 6 b2 equals to 2 and b3 equals to 
फोर प्लस टू आयोटा एंड बी फोर इक्वल्स टू फोर माइनस टू आयोटा सो दीज आर द फोर रूट ऑफ द गिवन इक्वेजन एंड नाउ वी वेरीफाई दीज फोर रूट्स सो दैट हेयर फर्स्ट वी कॉपी डाउन द गिवन क्वेश्चन स्टेटमेंट इट इज बी माइनस फोर एक्सपोन एंड फोर इक्वल्स टू सिक्सटीन सो हेयर फर्स्ट वी टेक बी वन इक्वल्स टू सिक्स नाउ वी नीड टू सब्टीट्यूट बी वन इक्वल्स टू सिक्स इन द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड and you see here this will becomes 6 minus 4 and its whole power 4 and we check that is this equals to 16 or not okay so this will be written as 6 minus 4 becomes here 2 to the power of 4 and we check is this equals to 16 so you clearly see that 2 to the power of 4 equals to 16 so 16 equals to 16 this shows that the uh, first root satisfies the given equation and now here we need to check the second root uh, so the second root is b2 equals to 2 so we check uh, the value of b2 here okay so now we take b2 equals to 2 so we put this value in the given question statement so it will be written as 2 minus 4 and its whole power 4 equals to 16 So you see here, two minus four becomes minus two to the power of four equals to sixteen. We check. So minus two to the power of four is sixteen equal to sixteen. This shows that the second value of b is also satisfies the given question statement. And now we move towards our third value. It is b three equals to four plus two iota. So now we check this value of b three in the given given question statement. So this is b minus four question statement. So in the left hand side we put this value. It will be written as four plus two iota minus four and its power is four equals to sixteen. So you see that this minus four and plus four are cancelled by each other, and we get two iota and its exponent is four equals to sixteen. We check that. Is this equals to sixteen or not? Okay, so here we know that two to the power of four equals to sixteen, and iota to the power of four, and we check is this equals to sixteen. Here uh, we know about iota. Iota is equals to minus one. So when you take the square on both of the sides, so iota square equals to minus one. So when you again take the square on both of the sides. Then you see here minus one square, so you get iota to the power of four equals to plus one. Okay, now we replace this iota to the power of four equals to one. Then finally you get sixteen equals to sixteen. This shows that third value also satisfies the given equation. Now we check the fourth value. So the fourth value is b four equals to four minus two iota. We put this value in the left hand side of the given equation, so it will be written as. A, Four minus two iota and minus four and its exponent is four equals to sixteen. This is cancelled by each other, and we get minus two iota and its exponent is four equals to sixteen. So minus two to the power of four becomes sixteen, and iota to the power of four. So we know that here iota to the power of four equals to one. So you get here sixteen equals to sixteen. This shows that. all values of b4 satisfy the given question statement and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos